Hey, hey, y'all. Welcome back. Welcome back. So we are back in CVS for the second time this week. But if you haven't seen my first CVS haul video, definitely check it out. I went to CVS yesterday on Sunday and I'm back here again on Monday doing a second haul. But if you're new to my channel, thanks for clicking my video. Do me a favor and subscribe and turn that bell notification button on so you don't miss any time I post multiple videos throughout the week and when I announce any giveaways that I'm doing. And then those that have been subscribed and you have that bell notification button on, I really, really appreciate you. But y'all, we are inside of CVS. I'm at the red box. I typed in my phone number so that way I could get my CVS coupons or my CRTs. Now let's see what deals we're going to do for the second time this week. Again, if you haven't seen the first CVS haul video, definitely check it out because I do have some easy, all digital free deals. But let's get into the video. All right, y'all. So this week, I did want to mention that the Maybelline is on a promotion where if you spend $12 worth, you get back a $4 extra buck. And at the red box or on your CVS app, you may see where you got a $4 off of any Maybelline, Maybelline, Maybelline cosmetics. So the cheaper route to go would be to pick up like the baby lip, which can typically be found there at the bottom. It's the cheaper of the products and they're $4 and 29 cents at my store. So you would just pay the 29 cents after that $4 CVS coupon or that CRT. Now, I did notice, though, on Abata, there was some rebates back for the Maybelline lip products, giving back $2. It excludes the baby lips. I did scan it, and it, it excludes the baby lips. But if you wanted to maybe pick up some of the other lip uh, products, and then maybe you have like a 5 off of 20 Maybelline or a 5 off of 12 Maybelline, you may be able to work out a great deal, especially if you were any of these items. So I just wanted to mention this deal. I'm not going to do it, but in the event you did uh, use Maybelline, you may be able to work out a good deal if, after those rebates and that CRT that uh, everybody got for this week. So y'all, look at what I came across this hand wash right here. So if you saw in my first haul that I did earlier, um, if you have it, definitely check that out. But y'all, I had a CRT for $1 off of when you spend $4.50 on this hand wash and like the Dove hand wash. And I got the Dove hand, well, if you haven't seen that video, check it out, but I could have just picked up this y'all. And if you've seen the video, you know what I mean, because this would have definitely put me at that $4.50 mark. But it's still good to know that there's some cheap hand soap out there if you do spot this at your store. You definitely may want to take it to the red box and confirm the price. Because if your store isn't tagged, it still may be $0.29, cent, even if the store doesn't have the tag on it. And then right here, I spotted these cleansing hand sanitizing wipes. They're 90% off. And when I took them to the red box, they were $0.30. Cents. So like if you're using a certain amount of extra bucks and you don't want to waste any of it, Let's say you're using like a $5 extra book, but what you're getting is like $4.50. You could maybe factor in this hand wash and maybe the $0.30 cent, um, sanitizing wipes. So that way you don't lose any of your money. But yeah, y'all, some amazing clearance and cheap finds. All right, y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and do the Colgate deal again. And... I'm going to get two of the Colgate's priced at $7.98. And then we do have a digital coupon, y'all, for $7.98 off of two, which makes two packages or two boxes of toothpaste completely free. Now, for those of you who may want to do some of the other Colgate deals, because I know we have some separate ones where if you buy three, you get back like a $5 extra buck. I know we have some other Colgate deals, I believe, going on as well. So you may want to factor that in. And if you have like a four off of 25, you can do that if you want to mix and match maybe Colgate and Crest deals. Um, or if you just want to stick to Colgate, I know in one of my accounts, I had like a five off of 20 Colgate. So always cater the deal to your need. And if you have like any threshold coupons, like a six off of when you spend 30, you definitely may want to factor this in because that's at least $7.98 helping you get to your $30 limit. I noticed that a lot of these trash bags are on clearance, y'all. So definitely want to be looking for them to drop or if you're in need of them, of course, this would be a good time to get them. But uh, it's rare that I see clearance trash bags like that. And then it's like hefty, looks like. Oh, it looks like it's just a hefty. 
but yeah a good quality brand i'm gonna go actually grab a few and just confirm because i want to make sure and see if the price has dropped probably not but i still just want to double check and they have a lot so i'm definitely going to keep my eye out but yeah if you can find some of these at your store you definitely may want to confirm the price um even if your store isn't tagged but you can't beat clearance um trash bags since that's something that and I know in my house we household we use regularly. So these actually rung up ten seventy nine, and these did ring up on um, clearance. So I'm definitely gonna wait and see if I can catch some that may have dropped or maybe a CVS that isn't tagged. But you can't beat that on trash bags. So y'all, they have some really cute sets. I know like on the ad they had one that had like a little nail dryer I think in it like one of the $10 sets here's some other ones right here oh this is pretty it's like a lip gloss this one actually I actually like this one and then what is this liquid what is this I don't know if that's lipstick or not but yeah y'all think I may get the bigger set because I know I have $4 expiring, but I have some other extra bucks that I could use and just get one of those sets. But what I may do is do the toothpaste deal that I did in my first CVS haul video. So again, if you haven't seen it, definitely check it out um, to see if I get like any threshold CRTs, like spend 30, get $6 off. Because if so, I may combine that into a good deal that way that'll end up probably being like a money maker so yeah i'm excited to see that my store has it all right y'all so i end up doing like a little separate transaction and i ended up getting an eight off of 40 on my receipt like i planned well i planned on getting a threshold i didn't know if it was gonna be like six off of 30 but i was hoping that i would get one and so i got an eight off of 40 y'all so I'm going to end up getting some money maker gift sets. So what I plan on doing is picking up two of the larger gift sets, which were priced at $9.99. And for buying one, you get back a $8 extra buck. And you can do this deal up to three times, but I'm just going to do the deal twice. So picking up two of the larger ones, I'll get back a total of $16 in extra bucks. And then I picked up two other smaller ones, which were priced at $4.99. And then for each one of those, you get back a $4 extra buck for buying one. And you can also do the smaller ones up to three times, but I'm just going to do those twice. So picking up two of the smaller ones, I should get back a total of $8 in extra bucks or $4 each. So picking up all four of these gift sets, two of the larger ones at $9.99 and then two of the smaller ones at $4.99, that totals me $29.96. So I'll pay that at the register, but then I should get back a total of $24 in extra bucks, y'all. 16 from the larger sets and then eight from the smaller sets. But remember, I do have that eight off of 40 threshold CRT that I plan on using. So what I'm thinking I'm going to do is just factor in like that uh, toothpaste that I was mentioning since that's going to be free and that's at least $8. And then I think I'm going to factor in that Maybelline as well. But we'll see. But I'm definitely going to do a great deal. It should end up coming out to be a money maker. But you still can't beat these gift sets if you were in need of them. All right, y'all. So if y'all saw my first haul video, then you know that I already had a minor hiccup. But I'm going to try to do this different deal again. This store is actually a little higher. The first store was priced at $10.29. But that's, I'm not going to get that one. I'm actually going to get this cleanser toner. Wait, is this the toner? I don't know if this is the toner or not. But it looks like it's priced at $9.99. And then I have a five dollar crt for the different a three dollar and fifty cent different uh crt and then i have a dollar 75 coupon that i was able to print from their website and then on Abata, there's a two dollar cash back rebate giving you two dollars which is going to end up making this about a dollar and ninety no end up making this a money maker like a over a two dollar money maker but i want to confirm the price because i don't know if this is the right one 
So let's just confirm. So update. This one actually went up $13.99. So it looks like it's in the wrong spot. So y'all, I'm gonna try it again. I'm gonna take one for the team and see if I if it'll work. So I'm gonna get this one again at $10.49. And um after my coupons and then like my about a rebate, this should be roughly like a dollar over like a dollar and fifty money maker. All right, y'all. So yeah, it's a it's a no go. It's not attaching. I don't know why. I'm thinking. I mean, the coupon says cleanser. It says it's a cleanser. But yeah, these are more expensive, and it's gonna not end up being a money maker. So I'm just not gonna get it. All right, y'all. So this is everything that I plan on picking up for my second CVS haul. Again, if you haven't seen the first one, definitely check it out but for my transaction um well i already did one transaction but for this transaction that i plan on doing um i picked up again four of the nail sets which totaled me 29 dollars 96 but i'll be getting back a total of 24 dollars in extra bucks because the bigger sets again you get back eight dollars and then the smaller sets you get back four dollars and you can do each set up to three times so i picked up two of each set so i've only did the deal twice but if i wanted to do each set one more time i could and then i picked up two of the colgate priced at seven dollars and 98 cents no priced at two for seven dollars and 98 cents and then we have a digital for seven dollars and 98 cents off of two which makes that completely free and again a great filler item and then i picked up the maybelline baby lip at four dollars and 29 cents and then I'll be using a $4 CRT. So you can use the paper version if you prefer, but I am gonna go ahead and just send it to my card and that should come off. So y'all, everything you see here totals me $42.23. So I do plan on using this eight off of 40 CRT, which will take off $8. But after all of my digital coupons and then my Maybelline uh, CRT comes off y'all, I'll pay $22.25 out of pocket, but then I'll get back, remember, $24 in extra bucks from the beauty cosmetic sets, making this a $1.75 money maker, y'all. So an amazing second haul to get all of these items for that amount. So you can't beat that. So let's head to the register, y'all, and check out. Fingers crossed. All right, y'all, so I went ahead and checked out. I wanna go ahead and show you the receipt. So there's the Colgate, there's the um, the $4.99 gift sets. There's both of those, and then there's the other two $9.99 gift sets, and then there's the Maybelline. And there's all of my coupons that I use. So my $7.98 for the Colgate, the eight off of 40. The $4 for the Maybelline did reduce down to $3.49, so I did end up paying like $0.50 cents more than I anticipated, which is still okay. And then I did use $22.17 in extra bucks to pay, leaving me to pay the $0.59 cents out of pocket. But y'all, so I spent, I spent what, $22.76 like out of pocket or somewhere around there? But y'all, I got that $16 for doing the large sets, which were $8 for each one. And I got back the $8 for doing the smaller sets, $4 each. So I got back $24 just like I planned, but only spent $22, making it, like I said, a dollar and some change money maker, y'all. So you can't beat that. To get items that you can really use for cheap and then to get paid to take them out the store. So I'm really happy with this second haul for the second time this week. But I definitely hope you all found this video helpful. Again, if you're new to couponing, definitely do that Colgate deal because that's an easy beginner all digital deal. But thanks for watching, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. And comment below where you all are from. Team Georgia, drop peaches down in the comments. But I'll see you all in the next video. And don't forget to check out my first CVS haul video if you haven't already. But all right, y'all. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.